Good morning, Cupcakes. It is a beautiful morning here in Zephyrtown. I hope your day is going wonderfully. For this episode, we've got the second spring bazaar of year three, so we're going to be picking up more jerseys, more Suffolks, and more Silkies. If we can, of course, there's always a possibility that Enrique will not be selling any of either, or he'll only be selling the adult versions. Um, but in addition to that, there is also a random event that I would like to trigger today, and if I and if we're successful doing that, then well, you'll see it in the in the thumbnail and the title of the video. And yeah, I think that's mostly everything. Oh, and the flower festival is also ending this this video, this episode, uh, I think on Sunday. And we also have to remember to make an herb salad uh, to wrap for Sherry, the bazaar tomorrow. Um, we could just, of course, use one that we bought at Jones Cafe back in winter, but I figure it'd be nice to use some high quality ingredients, so I gotta remember to do that. Right, Sherry? You're such a good husband, honey. You always make me smile. And we have no gifts for... Oh, that's right, because cause flowers. That's right, the flower festival. For the flower festival? Thank you, honey. Of course. Oh, and we've got some potatoes to harvest. We aren't going to be replanting anything um, in this row uh, this week. Or uh, not this week, today. Uh, just in case Roll decides to sell some cabbage this week at the bazaar, but... I don't know, we'll see. I Like I said before, I don't know if he actually can. Since he wasn't selling it um, this time around, I don't know if he actually can the next bazaar. It really hasn't seemed like that. And what am I... Ay, ay, ay. So, let's see what the strawberry on the end is like. Hopefully three stars. Nope, still two and a half stars, so... Yeah, it looks like the cucumbers are a bit ahead of the strawberries right now. For the record, Cindy... It's not- Oh my goodness, speaking of, let's actually go and get that triggered because, my goodness, I forgot. Hey. Can we get there in time? No, didn't mean to do that. No! We actually missed it! Ah, uh, shoot. I know you can trigger it on today. Hey there, what are you doing? Ray, shouldn't you be like working? Oh, thanks, Ray. Okay. Um, hello. Um, thank you very much. Good afternoon, Ray. Actually, let's give him a blue magic flower. Oh, for the flower festival? Thank you very much. And unfortunately, this is a random event that can only occur on Fridays, so. Missed that opportunity. Can't believe I did that. It's very important that you try and get that triggered ASAP because there's actually, well, not just because, okay, so first of all, there is um, another event that requires that you trigger the uh, problems with math random event. And not only that, but of course, you can only trigger that event on Fridays in good weather. Go ahead and hop in the river a few times as punishment for missing that random event. Uh, sea urchin, nice. I mean, not as nice as getting sea urchins were back at the start of the file, but you know, it's always nice to have that. We might end up setting some aside one of these days. I think sea urchins can really only be used as an at as an addition in recipes, but I could be wrong. Not even really sure what additions to recipes do in this game, to be quite honest. I think they just improve the quality of it, so if you're not using really high quality ingredients, then adding, say, a sea urchin to the sushi bowl or whatever um, sea urchins can be added to, uh, just improves the quality. Oh, that's right, Antoinette. We're supposed to give Antoinette a flower. 
Whoopsies. I'm sorry, you're not actually all that forgettable, Antoinette. I just happened to forget about you. If you made it this far in the video, don't forget to like it if you haven't already, to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already, and to let me know any thoughts you have down below. All that stuff really does help me out, and it helps my videos show up in your inbox more consistently, so do not forget. We only have one more tree that we need to get, and I believe Sherry sells that um, in summer of year three. And I forget what tree that is. Banana? I think it's banana. Ooh, and our animals! Our animals! And actually, before we go to bed, we are going to... I mean... Well, okay, we need to take all these with us, but... Uh, actually, Joan would probably really like a golden egg, wouldn't she? Because she likes eggs, so... I guess we might as well give her this golden egg. Since we don't... We don't know when... I mean, Chen's probably gonna be selling... The store next week? I don't know. We'll just give her the golden egg. We'll just give, uh, Joan the golden egg. For, uh... For her birthday this so week. Lavender. So... Let's see how it turns out. Let's be recorded. I'm pretty sure we already have the recipe, I'm just saying. Come on. Your cooking rank went up to head chef. If only it were that simple. Whoops. It's in a bowl, it's okay. Four star herb salad for Sherry. Did we have any produce last week? I don't think we would have. So I think this is the first week that we have our f our full five star non-regrowable rotation. Obviously because today is the flower fest, still is the flower festival. And uh, tomorrow, I think, is the last day of it. I don't know for sure. I'm gonna have to check at some point. But anyway, uh, we're not gonna be giving people any cooked dishes from the cafes, you know, to try out what they like. We will still be getting them. It's just that we won't... We'll be holding off on giving them as gifts until uh, Monday. All right, let's check real quick. No cabbage seeds from Raul. No oil from Chen, so yeah. We might as well give Joan this, uh, this golden egg. Gotta be careful not to sell these gifts, though. All right, we actually need to, uh, put some more stuff out now, I think. Oh my gosh, no, please, I'm sorry. Okay. My goodness. That was just everybody at once. I'm sorry, sir, I didn't mean... Everybody needed help at once. There was nothing I could do about that. Strawberries. Milk. Eggs. Peach tree seeds. Oh, goodness. Oh, could I have one of these peach tree seeds? You can have it for free. You can pay double for it. No, you can't have it. You can have it for free. Really? Wow, you're the nicest person I've ever met in my life. Just put plenty of fertilizer on them, and uh, give me one of those five-star peaches, so I can turn it into... Actually, do we have five-star peaches? Maybe. We might already have that. Goodness. We're already at over a hundred thousand, which is... Which is nice, but not anywhere near the goal, and I'm not sure we're actually going to meet the goal. This bizarre. Uh, we'll see, we still have a lot of produce and a lot of eggs to sell. Oh, how cute. Would you give me this egg? Sure, take it. You mean for free? Could you buy it, please? Can't remember, but I'm, I know sh sure, take it is not the, the right one. You can tell because of the little heart. Um, you mean for free? Oh yes, for free. Sorry I wasn't clear on that. I'll come back later. I think could you please pay for it gets you the most reputation for that. I think there is one or one, maybe not one or two, but <sighs> there's Freya just liking to watch, just wants to watch us work, apparently. Anyway, but yeah, I think there is one or two reputation uh, quizzes where your reputation can only just go up by five points at the most. I think that's the case, but I could be wrong. Potatoes, milk. 
give me a deal on this milk? For double the price. For half price, you can have it for free. You can have it for free. Are you sure? Thank you very much. Yeah. We might get on the leaderboards, but we're definitely not going to get first place. Um, I don't know if we're going to win on reputation. I don't think so. I think we're at, what, 25 reputation at this point? And we'd need to be a lot higher to have really much of a chance. Given, uh, given how little stuff we have left to sell. And once again, we're down to just the eggs. I was wondering if you could tell me where the wrapping stall is? Down and to the left. Oh, thank you for telling me. I'll come back later and buy something. No, you won't. Stop lying. It's fine. It's fine that you won't come back later and buy something. I'm, I'm happy to give directions. It is just, I don't like people lying to me, okay? 138,320. Still have a ways to go to meet the goal. Yeah, you're telling me. And... Mm, still no gold from Lloyd. Hello there. Welcome to Isaac's Info Center. Would you like to know all kinds of info, side info, Ray? It's 100G, okay? Sure. Well, this is just a rumor, really. In life, you'll have rainy days and windy days. There will be blizzards and typhoons. But if you don't give up, you may find something nice where you least expect it. Good things will happen to you if you just keep trying. If any other hot info comes along, you'll certainly hear about it. That sounds like something we'd hear from the fortune teller. Oh, hello. Welcome to my food stand. I don't think she has anything we want to be getting, though. And uh, no. Okay. Joan, we're going to do yellow wrapping paper. And... Okay, yeah. We're gonna do blue for Sherry and yellow for Joe. There you go. I hope that person. I hope that the person who receives this gift enjoys it. All right, and yellow for the golden egg for Joan. thing. Just one moment, please. Oh, and that's right, we also need to check for a wonderful. For, uh, for Diego to be selling a new wonderful. No, I think we already have the orange wonderful. I think it's the green one that we're wanting. Yeah, we already have that. So I think we're waiting on, on Diego to sell the green wonderful, but again, it's random. And even though we already have the summer sun, and we already have the orange wonderful, and we actually can't buy a second one of either, he'll still sell those. I guess the world doesn't revolve around us. Right, first first ticket of the Lucky Lotto, nothing. Second ticket. Special prize, we got the grand prize. Champagne, nice. Sometimes you win and sometimes you don't. Yeah, we, we've been not winning a lot, but hey, boy. Fourth place prize. Material stone. Oh boy. Joy. And blank. And one last one. Let's see. Fourth place prize. An egg. Okay. Because apparently I didn't have enough of those to sell. Welcome, welcome. Would you like your fortune red? It's just 100G. Sure, tell me my fortune. Abracadabra, what fate lies in wait for you? Relaxing is nice, but try adding some excitement to your life. So, did that night new at all? Feel free to come back anytime. Alright. And... Not... Oh! Is that... No, that's not the dog we're looking for. What am I thinking? Um, the dog we're looking for is the dark brown one. With pointy, with pointy ears. Alright, so... Fourth Jersey Cow. This one will be Arceus. Arceus okay? Yes. Thanks, take good care of him. And then our fifth Jersey Cow. So this is the last Jersey Cow that we're going to buy. And this is Soul Gal. So, Galeo. Alright. Yes, Soul Gal is okay. 
Now let's see what else he's got, because I wasn't paying attention. I know he has an adult Suffolk, but we're not getting that. And that looks like the only Suffolk he has. Okay. So, we will instead be going for us. Is that the only baby Silky he has? I think so. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. So we already have Rayqua, so this one will be Cressel. So we still need four Suffolk sheep and uh, eight silky chickens before we fill up our barn. But that's okay. Thanks, take good care of them. Let me move that out of the way. All right. Now I think all that's left for us to do here is to go shopping at the cafes. Ooh boy. Welcome to my cafe. Red wine glass. I don't know how to put red wine in a glass. Okay. There. <laughs> She'll teach me the recipe for putting red wine in a glass. Oh, this is a silly place. Zephyr Town is a silly place. Alright, what's this? What she's got here? Cappuccino, hash browns, ooh, nice. And cheese croquette. Now that sounds delicious, doesn't it? I don't think anyone would have hash browns as their favorite recipe. So we're gonna go ahead and not try that, but we are going to try cheese croquettes. Which I don't think anyone has as their favorite recipe, but we're gonna try it anyway. ourselves a nice cheese croquette before we go giving flowers and selling that champagne. Mm. Oh, delicious. All right, chicken egg, material stone, that's 250 not, But this one is enough to more than pay for our ticket. So isn't that nice? Champagne, egg, Material stone. So yeah, 1920 for that, which nice little profit from our gamble, but uh, usually doesn't turn out like that. All right, 140,490G, and fortunately that's as far as we're gonna get for the gold. Hi, Felix. But we should be third on the leaderboard, I think. Absolute of utmost importance that we brush, brushy brush brush, our, our silky, or our Suffolk rather. I called a, <laughs> called it a silky sheep in the last episode. I don't know if you noticed. Little ridiculous. I think we can plant asparagus seeds. Yeah, we'll go ahead and plant some asparagus seeds. And even if they're not done by the next bazaar, oh well. Great! Looks like everybody is here! It's time to announce the bazaar results! Our top three earners in third place with 140,490G! I think that's us. Ray, congratulations! We'll do better next week, though. In second place with 176,000G! Lloyd Store, congratulations! Hey, good job, Lloyd. Please sell gold next time. Please, I am begging you. And in first place with 230,000G! Absolutely crushed us. Good job, Wilbur. Wilbur Store, congratulations! And the person with the happiest customers was... Wilbur! The customer said your service was top-notch! You ruled on the down proud! Keep up the good work! For being in the top three, Ray will receive a token of thanks! An herb perfume! I hope you like it! For a goal to be the best bazaar in the world, we made it! A little past halfway. 
That's not bad, but we'll need to do a lot better next time to meet the goal. Our goal for the next bazaar is 150,000 to 200,000 G. We can do it. Well, that's all for now. Start getting ready for the next bazaar. I think I actually know someone who might like this sort of perfume. We are really using up these seeds a lot faster than I thought we would be. I mean, it doesn't help that Roll didn't sell cabbage seeds, because if he had sold the cabbage seeds, then we'd be fine. We wouldn't have this extra row of of crops that we'd be that we were growing. But it's fine. We'll be fine. We will survive. We're not gonna be using all of our our seeds, I don't think. And if we do, well, we can just turn the crops into more seeds. My goodness. All of these weeds. The game heard me complaining about the weeds, and here's the moondrop flower for Sherry. What is... I'm hacking. I'm gonna get accused of hacking. Like, what is the probability of all those weeds plus the moondrop flower for Sherry? Thank you, honey. Not that there's actually any benefit to giving her presents now. Just for the record, you don't actually need to give your spouse presents every day. As long as you keep their friendship at max. Their max hearts. But I... I like doing it anyway. And still only four star eggs from the Tao Trail. Unfortunate. Hey, our tea bushes are fully grown. Yes. So in a few days, we'll be getting five a star spring tea leaves. Which mean, which we can turn into five star matcha. Which is insanely good profit. Harvest these pineapples. Neither potatoes, neither ugh, tomatoes, nor corn done. Which, I mean, we could wait on that to, to change the autumn sun. I am pretty sure, by the way, that, uh, that wheat can grow in autumn, but I guess we'll, uh, we'll see. Oh, that's right. You can't take it out of storage for some unknown reason. It only checks your bag. The fall sun, sorry. Yes. And we will replace it with the fall sun. And then the pineapples and the corn and the tomatoes will die. Um... I guess we'll find out tomorrow if the other stuff will die, but, um, yeah, we're not gonna do anything about that right now, though. We gotta get to foraging and head on over to the Flower Festival announcement and see if we won. Time for the Flower Festival announcement! Ready? Let's start. Great! Let's get started! Thank you all for coming! And now to announce the person who gave out the most flowers! Ladies and gentlemen, the winner is... Ray! Congratulations! Three-time champion. Thanks for putting a smile on everyone's face! And my thanks to everyone for making this a great flower festival! Well, hopefully I can continue to put smiles on everybody's faces, even when it's not the Flower Festival. This is very nice, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Oh, he actually likes cheese croquettes, nice. Oh, for me? Thanks. Who doesn't like croquettes? Thanks, I'm impressed that you know what I like. Especially cheese croquettes. For me, th thank you very much. I really like this, thanks. I really don't like this, sorry. Oh my goodness, really, Ethel, please. Say it ain't so. Say you weren't the one person in town that doesn't like cre cheese croquettes. <laughs> wow, well, thank you very much. Thank you. How thoughtful. Even Claude likes them. Come on. Right? Oh. Thanks. I'll take it. Ethel is apparently the only person in Zephyr Town that does not like cheese croquettes. Or is at least neutral to them. I mean, of, of course, we didn't give any to Stuart or Daisy or uh, um, or Sherry, but... Uh... 
My... All of my respect for Ethel, just gone. Sorry, it's just... Sorry, I'm just... Broken heart. Now... Eggplant seeds? Yo. Yo. Yam seeds? Oops. Yo. Yo. And we'll go ahead and bunch up... Oh wait, no. Oh, okay, yeah. Yellow pepper seeds. Okay, so th the entire bottom row taken by regrowables. Um, cauliflower, honestly, we should probably do th all three rows of cauliflower that we can plant, and then take up the rest with spinach, and not even bother with the carrots at the moment. And then, don't forget the bell icon! Let's bell icon Espeon. So that's how you- that's how you get someone to love you, is you bell icon. Sorry uh, for missing out on that random event that I wanted to trigger in. Sorry that this is a three-day episode instead of a four-day like I had hoped for, but I hope you still enjoyed it. I hope that the rest of your day is a good one, and I hope to see you later. Bye.